Hi everyone, in this tutorial, really quick tutorial, I will show you how to edit your image in Lightroom while you're shooting on a bright background and you struggle with editing. First of all, look at my settings. I have a temperature 6200 and tint 1. This is a Lightroom settings, I didn't touch anything. I usually shoot already with a really warm Kelvin around 6500. It's just so much easier to work later on. By the way, I shot this uh, picture with a natural light. I also will do some, I will also do tutorials with the uh, studio light because the editing is slightly different. But how to fix this when you see the uh, skin is have like red blemishes it's um, have yellow spots it's red and the background is way too bright is way too much and you don't know where to start i will uh, walk you through my editing process first i'm telling you i never touch the exposure but we're gonna go through all the panels Exposure and contrast. I never touch exposure because I try to expose my pictures already right from the start while I'm shooting. All I can touch is probably curves. If I want to make the image a little bit brighter, that's it. Contrast between four and five. Those settings are pretty much it's um, all I do for my images. Like I do this every time with every single image. Dep doesn't matter if you're doing with natural light or with studio light this is just what i really like highlights and shadow highlights and shadows uh, will help to bring the contrast more contrast into the image and if you shoot with the light like i do which is you see it's um, really pronounced shadows and highlights that's uh, that will work but if your light is more flat it's not going to look as great keep this in mind when you're editing your photos I go with highlight a little bit to the right and shadows a little bit to the left to bring this contrast. I don't touch whites and blacks. Next, clarity between 4 and 5, dehaze between 1 and 4, depends on the image, here is 1, uh, vibrance and satur saturation. Here I don't need to bring any more vibrance to the picture, it's already pretty vibrant. Um, I would say it's even too uh, saturated therefore i will bring saturation down by two not too much i don't want it we'll work in photoshop later you will i will make another tutorial how to edit um, how to do the color correction in photoshop next we um, see the panel hue saturation in luminosity most photographers work in this panel personally i prefer to work with uh, this panel camera calibration which is so amazing and works so much better i'll tell you the difference between this panel and this i'll try my best to explain if you see this red overcast in your image and if you try to work with for example hue in red and try to reduce the red obviously you want to add orange the orange will appear in the whole image and it will literally turn look at this orangey kind of like really muddy which is not pretty but if you go down to camera calibration and go to red primary and adjust hue here look at this you have a totally different look how those panels work camera calibration work different totally different way in every single color for example red inside the red we have red green and blue therefore it's our rgb red green and blue and when you adjust in, uh, red in camera calibration this red primary slider will take the red out of every single color if green has red it will take this red out if blue has red it's take all red will take red out therefore this panel is so much better but if you go to this panel it'll just work just with red and you see how it look like not pretty because it doesn't touch red in the green channel or in the blue channel sure enough sometimes it's really cool to use this panel i will tell you later what i'm using it for but in this case 
I will I will touch just the I will adjust just red primary and I'm gonna go probably round 16 which is will create in this image and I will reduce the saturation of the red by three and I see right now all yellowy overcast in the yellow you can adjust in green primary by sliding slide slider saturation just a little bit not too much you see it's way too much I'll just show you how it's work just a little bit for example minus five and I will get the yellow out of the blue minus five awesome I really like it and uh, and orange color I will adjust in the panel hue saturation luminosity orange just a little bit don't do too much or image will look dirty that will not hue I'm sorry not this one saturation of orange let's do minus minus four I love it and look our before and our after I think it's already great all we need right now to finish this image in Photoshop and I will show you how to do this in my next tutorial I hope you enjoyed if you have any questions ask me down below I will answer them thank you for watching